The oil and gas industry understands separating water out of a mostly gaseous stream. But we are less comfortable with the flip side of that coin, separating gas out of a mostly liquid stream. This separation task relies on different fluid forces and requires different pressures and internal configurations than traditional separators. The patented gas buster from Mule Shoe Engineering is able to facilitate these non-traditional conditions and it has an internal configuration designed for removing gas from liquid. Mule Shoe Engineering was founded with the goal of applying field engineering and operational concepts to field engineering problems. The Gas Buster is one of these field concepts. In many onshore gas wells with downhole pumps, the velocity in the annulus is too slow for the gas to drag liquids along with it, and the gas that flows into the separator is essentially dry. We've observed that when we combine a nearly gas-free liquid stream with a nearly liquid-free gas stream in a separator for a few seconds, we end up adding water to the gas stream and adding gas to the liquid stream. Rather than combining two single-phase streams, many operators pump directly into a tank or water gathering system. There is always some amount of gas entrained in the pumped water, so this gas will eventually be vented into the atmosphere, eliminating the opportunity to sell it while risking fines for emitting so-called greenhouse gases. The Gas Buster addresses both the short duration for separation in a traditional separator and pumped gas by utilizing excess horsepower from downhole pumps to transfer water without the need for surface pumps and tanks. It is also able to capture pumped gas without added compression. Under normal operations, the gas outlet stays shut while the water outlet remains open. As pumped well fluids enter through the inlet pipe, the internal piping configuration separates the pump gas and distributes the separated fluids, transporting the gas to the top of the vessel through a standpipe. A float triggers the opening of the gas outlet once enough gas has accumulated. A back pressure valve ensures that the unit is at a higher pressure than the sink. This elevated pressure pushes the gas into the gas sales line. As the downhole pump forces more liquid into the system, the float begins to float again and the gas outlet shuts. Fluid flowing back into the vessel compresses the residual gas at the top, raising the pressure to the point of opening the water check valve and allowing the water to flow into the water system. A bottom float is also in place to automatically close the water outlet in the event that a large quantity of gas is slugged through the downhole pump. With the Gas Buster, you'll see increases in your sales volumes, while outgassing from tanks is reduced. Every well is different, but we've been able to quantify pumped gas collected on a number of wells that averaged 50 MSCF per day, with one well showing 245 MSCF per day of pumped gas. A $150 to $1,000 per day increase in gas sales can pay off this equipment very quickly. Call, email, or visit us online for more information.